hey you guys what's up it's your girl alicia jones and i'm back again with a new video and in today's video you guys already know what it is because y'all read the title today's video i'm going to be doing a black owned haul now um i think it's been about a year since i did my last black owned haul i collected a couple of things over these past couple of weeks and i wanted to show them to you guys so without further ado if you're interested in this stay tuned don't forget to like comment and subscribe and let me know some black owned businesses that i could possibly check out all the information will be linked down below so you guys can check out these wonderful companies so first off i am going to show you this is the afro puff hat that i was sent from tonydaily.com this right here y'all i have been rocking this the last couple of days because i do not feel like doing my hair so i'm gonna show y'all okay don't tell nobody this okay but this what we look like underneath right so i don't feel like doing my hair so bam that's all i gotta do you feel me like plain simple quick easy back and i mean who gonna check me boo if you can see what's going on that mean you too close back up okay social distancing and then i got this necklace also as well from tonydaily.com so yes y'all this is so cute check it out you guys quick simple throw it on i've been wearing this for the past week and i've been enjoying it because I have been doing nothing to my natural hair, which I know it's not good, but hey, this is enabling me. <laughs> okay, you guys, so next I wanna show you these earrings that I got from Keys Gifts and Crafts. My girl Keisha sent these over and she puts all the gems and jewels on everything. So she does shoes, earrings, whatever else. I have everything posted below, but y'all, I'm rude, I didn't even show y'all what she made ain't these so cute though so i'm gonna throw these on real quick so you guys can see them but look at that cute right i just love that so much yes girl and they go good with it the they go so good these are so so cute. I forgot what she called these. I'll uh, have a link what she calls these. I think it's Phenomenal Woman. They call Phenomenal Woman. So beautiful. All right. So let me show y'all her card. I don't even know if you guys can see that. But that's her card with the info up on there. And then there we go right there. Bam. Okay. So next, I'm going to show you guys some necklaces, some necklaces that I got from Beauty Melanin. Now, these, um, this necklace I discovered on Instagram uh, ad. So I was like, "Ooh, they black on too. Gotta check them out." So this is one of the necklaces that I got. I got three. I ordered um, three, and I think for all three. It was $48 and I got them all the medium length. So what I should have did was got a short, a medium and a long. That way they would have been layered and I could have wore all three. But that's the first one. So cute you guys. And then I'm gonna show y'all the other two. And I've been getting so many compliments. I think this one is my favorite. But yes, so cute, right? So cute. And then I'm going to show y'all the third one. I'm keeping these together in my jewelry pouch so they don't get messed up. And then this is the last one. Now these are supposed to be tarnish free, which I love because I hate when I wear jewelry and it starts changing colors and turning green and just not the colors that you purchase them as. Now, that's what this one looks like. It is Africa 
Y'all, I've gotten so many compliments on these necklaces. There you go. I'm trying to show it to y'all without that glare. But, so cute, right? All right, you guys. So, the next thing I got, I got from this company. And I think it's Nod Era and Company. I don't want to say their name wrong, which I'm pretty sure I did. But I ordered this. Now this one I got in silver and it just spells my name because I wanted to match my ring. But this one I like that it give you the option to pick silver, gold, or I think it might have had another one. But this is just what it looks like. So I will be rocking this and they gave me a coupon of 15% off for my next purchase, which I'm not going to ever argue about percentage off. But the packaging of this is so cute. Pink is one of my favorite colors. And then you guys, last but not least, this one I purchased from Target. So this sunscreen that I purchased from Target, made for us by us, honey. This is the Black Girl Sunscreen Bye Bye Umbrella. This is a moisturizing sunscreen lotion for your face and your body which i love but what i like most about this is water resistant and it did not leave any residue because i've used sunscreens that you look like you literally put on calamine lotion y'all know what i'm talking about this one i love so much see no white residue it's ultra sheer y'all it don't have that weird smell. I use this so much when I went to Florida re recently. I went to Florida recently. And that Florida sun is a lot different than the Missouri sun. So this helped me a lot. And then also, okay, the, the cap broke. So it kind of spilled out a little bit. So it looks kind of gross. But this one, this is the Black Girl Sunscreen. This is the Make It Matte Sunscreen Gel for the face. Now... I have sensitive skin, so I have to be weary of certain or cautious of certain things I use for my skin because it'll, it don't do my skin right. My skin will either break out or it'll do, be doing some weird to get these dry patches. This did not do that to my skin at all. I put it on my face. Now this one is 45 F. This is 45 S P F. I don't know why it was so hard for me to say that. But this one is water resistant as well. Now it did not, when my when I got wet, it didn't like start running and get my eyes. It didn't do any of that. I did not have any issues with that at all. And I just like that it goes on clear, it goes on smooth, it goes on sheer. It don't leave no residue, none of that. So y'all need to find this. You can find it at Target. This is where I purchased it from. Uh, I'm not sure where else they have it. They definitely should have it on, they should have a website. So I'll link that below, um, blackgirlsunscreen.com. So yeah, and always, you also wanna make sure you put this on 15 minutes before your sun exposure. But y'all, yes, 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 yes. I love this so much. Only thing is I do wish that it was a little bigger cause I'm about to be out, but. <laughs> All right, you guys, that is pretty much it for my black owned haul. Don't forget to like. Make sure y'all leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to check these companies out. Like this video, share so y'all can get the word out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. If you have a black owned company that you want me to check out, leave it down below. But I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Thanks so much for watching. Support a sister.